What's good with you guys? Hope you guys are doing well physically and mentally. Today, we're gonna to talk about your power of attraction. Now, what I mean by this is, when you see nice things in real life, right? And you, and you, and you continue to see things that are really nice for life. Maybe you might see luxury items in real life or things you actually wanna obtain in real life. You see uh, it come towards you, right? You might see a nice car that you like drive past all the time or you see it all the time. Things of that nature, right? People like to say, oh, that's a coincidence. People like to believe in coincidences and that simply is just not true, right? I feel like as we get older, we tend to lose our kid-like selves with those type of things because the kid if they would have seen that they would be like oh my gosh they're gonna make it to seem like they would have that type of thing somewhere in the future because they see it so much right and as adults and as teenagers we have to really keep that and have to be able to have that right because it's true if you think you see that thing maybe you might see a Rolls Royce coming or something that is just so much you see of that is so much and it's luxury to you or something that you want it could be something little but it's something that you want or that you desire that thing is for you that thing's attracted to you that's why you see it so much it's not a coincidence there is no coincidence in life life is literally in front of you it unfolds in front of you so once you see those things and now you put yourself in that elevated mindset oh yeah my hazard since that thing is coming towards me now your mind is in that mental state of that thing and now you can achieve that thing because in order to have materialistic things we have to have that mental state or mental attitude of that thing right we have to be able to be on the frequency or in that mental capacity of that thing in order to have that thing just with anything right because if you shoot low you're gonna get low if you shoot high you're gonna get high and even if you don't get as high as you wanted you'll get way closer than what you've done if you were to shoot lower than that so once you see those things, don't be like, oh, that's nothing. That's just nothing. Then it's going to be nothing, right? Because everything is, is what you make it. It is. It is. You see that thing you want. You see that type of girl you like. That, that You see all, just anything, right? Anything. It could be a type of girl. It could be, you see a type of car. You see a type of dog you want. You see it all the time. It's attracting to you because that's what it is. Your life, life attracts it, itself to you depending on how you are, right? Because your life is created by your thought. Real talk. It is. So if you if you were the type of person to be like, oh, it's just a coincidence, then a lot of things in your life is not going to be as great as you think it is, right? You're going to not see signs before they happen, right? Things happen in your life and you see signs before they happen. You're just going to think things are coincidences. So you're not going to even think of anything or you're just going to think things are nothing. So you're just going to be like, oh, well, that's nothing. When really it's everything. It's really what it is. So once again, when you see that thing that you are attracted to and it keeps attracting to you and it, you keep seeing it all the time and it keeps coming to you think that it's coming for you think that you're gonna have that think that it's that is you think that you will achieve and get whatever that is because you are it's attracted to you it's coming to you for a reason everything is life is for a reason right everything is life is for a reason say that even if you're attracted uh, you see butterflies all the time that can mean Butterflies in a spiritual manner mean literally to transform, to grow. Because, right, a butterfly first came from a caterpillar in order to be, not a caterpillar, it was like came out of a cocoon. Then from a cocoon, it sprouted into a butterfly. It means you're transforming, right? A lot of things in life are signs. And a lot of us, I, at some point in my life at one time, I didn't really care for the signs. But as I started to really live life and reflect back on things, I would see the signs before things would happen in my life. And as I reflect, I'm like, oh my gosh, there's patterns here. There's patterns of things that are gonna happen in my life that make my life this way, right? And so once you see those things, you start seeing more, say if you're seeing more butterflies, you see more nice things, you see more things you want, you're seeing the finer things that you want. And they're like, we, my bad. Other times in your life, you haven't seen those things. Other times in your life, you're like, I never seen that. And now it's starting to pop up. It's not a coincidence. It's not. And don't think it is. Because it's not. It's coming for you. You just got to keep yourself at that mental state as it's coming for me. It's coming for me. It's coming for me. It's there. It's for me. It's for me. Anything you want is for me. 
once you keep thinking of that, you're going to keep seeing it and seeing it. And you're going to do things that are going to make you acquire to have it. Because the first state of having things is the mental, right? You can have it mentally and then get it physically, right? It's that simple. It's not rocket science. It's not. And people like to make life seem like it's so rocket science-y. And so this, the signs are in front of you, bro. Everything's in front of you, man. Everything. Everything. Because how are you supposed to have a certain thing if you can't see signs? How are you supposed to have a certain thing if you're not there mentally, right? If you're not believing in what you see. You might as well believe in what you see. And you might as well even have faith that you're going to have it too because that's a big factor. You get me? So, next time you're out and you're thinking, you're visualizing things you want in your life, and you start seeing those things pop up in your life, hey, that is your sign to keep going all in what you want. Keep going. That's your sign to keep being on that mental state. That's your sign to keep yourself high mentally. Because when you're high mentally in a great state, you're going to get high things. You're going to get high luxury things or high things, high quality things in your life that you value. Because now your mind is on that state. Now your mind's attracted to that. And life is attracting that to you. You get me? So, if you're attracting luxury, if you're attracting the things you want in your life, but it's not fully yours yet, God's given earth is telling you that is going to be you if you keep staying on that state. If you keep staying where you're at and you keep on getting better at where you're at and you keep on being at high mental states, it's telling you. You're seeing butterflies. You're seeing ladybugs. You're seeing different things. Those mean things. Those mean things, people. God will give you signs in your life that things are going to grow. That things are going to be great. That things are going to be better than what they ever have been. You understand? So stop taking things as, oh, yeah, um, that's just a coincidence. That's not nothing. Oh, I'm seeing this thing that I always want that I never used to see before. But now I'm seeing it because I'm thinking about it so much. Oh, it doesn't mean nothing. No, you're seeing it because you're thinking about it. And when you're thinking about it, you're attracting it to yourself. That's what the whole point of it is for you thinking of it. Right? For you to attract it. Right? Even sometimes it's just attracted to you. It's just because of who you are sometimes. You're not even thinking about it. It's just who you are. Because you are that. And it was destined for you to be that. So now it's attracted to you. And so you can't, you have to play your part into realizing that and now putting your state in that state. Like, oh my gosh, that is going to be me. Oh my gosh, I'm going to have that. Oh my gosh. I'm going to be this. Oh my gosh. I see this girl. I'm going to have this. Oh my gosh. I see it. Oh my gosh, I'm growing. I see the, I see the butterfly. I'm growing. Right? That is you. So don't forget that. Please don't forget that. Don't take anything as a... It's a coincidence. It's a kawinky dink. Because nothing in life really a coincidence. A kawinky dink. It's a sign. And you have to realize that and open your mind to that. You have to. Realize that. And you'll be fine. Because you're divinely guided by God. Hey guys. I rockin' with y'all. Y'all rockin' with me. All 1,079 of you guys. I love y'all, man. Let's keep going up, y'all. Appreciate all the subs. Let's keep doing our thing. Love y'all.